Hi, Vince. It's nice Hi. to see you. Um, I just wanted to ask, what was the uh, the process in the um, in Dare, and how it was recorded, and getting involved with Stan Bush, and like who the musicians were, and things like that. You're talking specifically about the song Dare. Yes. Um, they. I'm, I'm trying to think if somebody came to me and said we want you to write a song I think that was more my decision and I asked the record company and the film company can I write a song for this uh, I had done a, a movie called Staying Alive and it was a hit record that we had called Far From Over so I thought it would be great if I could write another song for another movie and I wrote this song just thinking of you know positive energy basically I didn't write the lyrics uh, I gave that to a friend of mine named Scott Shelley, and he came back with a lyric, perfect. You know, I didn't have to change a thing. And then we got Stan involved. Basically sent the, the I, think, I think I was singing on the demo so Stan could be guided as to what to sing. Because um, I'm not near, nearly as good of a singer as Stan, but I can get a point across to, to a good singer. And then Stan just came in and nailed it, you know. So that was the process. And, and it, I wasn't in the studio when he recorded his vocals. I was basically producing the music. And a guy named Richie Wise produced Stan singing the, all the, the backgrounds and the lead singing stuff. So that's the process. OK, perfect. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Hey. Hey, Vince. Hi. How's it going? Good. Good. So I have a question for you uh, regarding a, I, I guess, I know this was a third party project or like a, like a side project that was done. You ever heard of the album Respect the Prime, 1986 Revisited? I don't, what's uh, it called? Respect the Prime. Don't know that. Okay, so it was a few years ago my brother and I first came to you, I think it's 2016 or 2017. There's a guy that was selling this record. Um, it's basically a compilation of artists, like small time artists, who did uh, covers of all of your music wow. that both this uh, the comp uh, orchestral composer and the other songs wow. um, and they're really cool a lot of them really hit home and really nice not as good as yours of course no they're nice uh, okay. um, but it's on iTunes and Spotify and I just wanted to know if you knew anything about that or if you heard of it or no I never okay. heard about it that sounds no? cool though yeah, I'd like it, to check it out it's local stuff yeah so like iTunes or uh, Spotify we have it and it has CD as well um it's called Respect the Prime, so let's look for that. It should show up on the search bar. And, and is, it, is it synthesizers, or is it orchestrated? Or? Uh, yeah, a bit of both, yeah. Oh, okay. Like The Touch and Death of Prime, Dare. Oh, but Subdicon is my personal favorite of the whole album. It's really, really good. Close second to yours. It's really nice. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, really cool, like revamped, 80s, revisited kind of style music. It's really, really nice and cool. And if you haven't heard of it, I recommend checking it out because it's... I, I got to you know, check it, it out. Yeah, Definitely. So. I didn't know it existed. Thank you for letting yeah, me know. Well, and other than that, just thank you again for coming. We really appreciate your work because you were one of those like forerunners of Transformers to help make the franchise the way it is today. And I think I speak for everyone when we say your music is awesome. Thank you. So thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right.